Meet Ratanak, a successful business owner from Cambodia. I work here as a barber. That's my job, to work as a barber. Contracting polio as a child meant his life would be challenging. I became deaf and I also started having problems with my legs. Ratanak was not literate and he had no friends. Until support from Caritas Australia led to a just future. And if you look at Ratanak right now, he's very independent. This is his story. I think I was four years old. I was still pretty young when I was sick. Polio and fever left Ratanak living with a disability, deaf and isolated. I would see hearing people going to school every day. I really wanted to go and learn as well, but as a deaf person, I did not have the opportunity to study. However, these circumstances didn't dampen his ambition. I kept asking to go to Phnom Penh to work. My older sister kept saying, why do you want to go to Phnom Penh? You're deaf, you're disabled, you can't go. Then she found the Deaf Development Program. The Deaf Development Program provides education, support and job training to help deaf people develop their own community. There are more than 51,000 deaf people in Cambodia. Deaf people need sign language in order to communicate. But their parents cannot sign, their neighbour cannot sign. Deaf people are among their family, but in fact they are isolated. I didn't know how to communicate. They would hand me a piece of paper, but I couldn't read. The goal of the Deaf Development Program is to help deaf people to achieve independence and to be respected and accepted in all aspects of Cambodian society. They taught me the alphabet and slowly I was able to develop my skills so that I could meet and communicate with other deaf people and I was very happy about that. Now Ratanak is literate, can communicate, and his business is doing well. Now I'm very confident in my ability as a barber. I've come for a haircut here for three or four years now. He does it fast and beautifully. I really like to have people with their hairstyle. His family is also thriving. He and his hearing wife, Farom, have a new baby. For me, it doesn't matter if someone's hearing or deaf. You can love them just the same. Ratanak taught me sign language. He is deaf, but he's literate, so it's easy to communicate. We can now have deeper conversations. Caritas Australia is the International Aid and Development Agency of the Catholic Church in Australia. With your help, we've worked alongside local partner Mary Knoll to support the Deaf Development Program in Cambodia. I'm so proud Ratanak has barber skills. I would very much like to see Ratanak have a good future, good children and grandchildren. Ratanak's story demonstrates how your generous donations uphold dignity and bring lasting change to vulnerable communities. I really want to say thank you for that and I really love the Deaf Development Programme. I can't thank them enough. Thank you Australian people for helping DDP with our work. Thank you. Caritas Australia helps educate young people with disabilities to build the skills they need to create the life they deserve. A just future starts with compassion. A just future starts with your generous support. Donate to Project Compassion today.